Hello everyone, Smox here from Celebrant Quest, and we're back in Above Snakes. Um, so, to begin the day, I need to go and hand in um, the quest that we just completed on the last episode. If I could just go the right way. <laughs> we killed all of the skeletons, um, so we'll go and hand in that quest. I know I've said this a million times, I really need to work out how to create a hitching post at my place so that I can travel between my shelter and the trading post. Um, okay, so we've got retrieve the merchandise bandits or bandits. Um, let's do a seven star, I mean, may as well. It We get the better reputation points. All right, what have we got in the storage? Oh, we finally got the hat. Bounty hunter hat. Gear level 1, adorned with rifle ornaments. Oh gosh, this hat is worn by the best bounty hunters. Alright, protection 1, range damage 3. Add damage versus most wanted enemies 20%. Ooh, that's cool. Alright, why don't we put that on? Um, actually, how do I put that on from this little menu? Where's our character? There we are. Okay, so we want the headgear. Okay, 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 hang on. I will work this out. F, equip. Okay. <laughs> Let's take a look at us. Yes, we've got the hat on now. What do we look like? Oh my gosh. We look very, very cool. Very cool. Okay, so, um, alright, let's put the bandits down, may as well. It's another prairie piece. Um, okay, I don't have enough arrows to go after them but I do have an axe um let's just be, be brave and try the axe what happens with this horse nothing okay <laughs> nothing <laughs> alrighty come on bandits let's go let's see if I can just like I don't know juke them oh he's the one with a um oops no juking oh my god you're throwing that Watch out! Yeah, 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 yeah! Oh, I thought it was going to hit your mate. No. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Watch the bomb. If that could hit your mate, that'd be awesome. Oh, how did I still get hit? Jeez, I'm really bad at this. You're a little bit harder than your, um... The previous enemies. Why are you still following me? Oh, okay, they despawned. Can I collect anything now you've blown that up? No. Oh, sugar, they're there. Dude, they just res... What the hell? They're just spawning. Okay, that is very strange. Alright, never mind. <laughs> Let's get some... <laughs> we'll need to get some um, flint. Let's get some health back. And we'll go and shoot them instead. How about that? <laughs> Sounds good to me. Um... Alright, that heartbeat sound is very disconcerting. Alright, we definitely need some water. Um, we'll eat some of our grilled fish as well. There we go. Okay. Um, let's search some trees. We probably need some feathers. It would be nice if there was a more efficient way to gather feathers for our arrows. I just don't know what it is. Oh, come on. Where are the feathers? Whee! <laughs> nope. Nope, just branches. Okay. We're going to carry a lot of branches home. Oh my gosh, seriously? Oh, there's one feather. Brill. <laughs> um, so... Oh, I should have talked to the, um, the NPC at the trading post to see if he had any kind of little quest for me, but, um, I forgot to. My bad. <laughs> I was thinking about going down to 
the lumberjack and seeing what they've got for me. Um, they might have they might have an extra quest, I don't know. Um, how do I turn the rocks into flint? No, not here. Oh, a gazebo wall. Decorative trellis wall with ivy growing on it. Oh, a plank door. You can upgrade your building. Oh, that's nice. Plank step. Oh, that's really lovely. Um, okay, sorry, getting distracted. Um, yeah, how do I make... Is it handcraft? Okay, here we go. Let's make a couple of these. And then we can make a few arrows. I've got 12 feathers. Oh, I didn't realize that. How did I get 12 feathers? All right, let's make a few more bits of flint then. Um, fletching table. Okay. What about these bows? I need an ingot and a and birch bark. I still don't know. I wonder if I try to cut down. It's a pine tree. I need to find birch trees. Then I'm guessing. Hmm. Okay. Can we smell? Oh, you can make some nails. I don't. I think we've already got a shovel, don't we? Let's have a look in our equipment. Yes. Oh, that's right. Okay. Have we got any ingots to smelt? Let's see. I've got to go past actually the ingot um, deposit. Uh, ingot deposits. The iron deposits. And also have to um, see if we can make anything, uh, mine any more metal ingots. Um, anvil, pickaxe, and a tin axe. Do I already have them? What have I got equipped? Enhanced pickaxe. Um, no, that's not what I've got equipped, is it? Enhanced axe is equipped. What's the pickaxe that's equipped? It appears that does it appear that I don't have one? Mind you, I have one down here. What's that? It looks like it is. Yeah. Okay. I already have it equipped. All right. What am I talking about? <laughs> I'm just losing my mind. Um. Okay. All right. Nothing good there. Let's check the workbench. Um, a stove, a piano. Do you know what we should do? We should make the base a little bigger, perhaps. Because I just feel like inside it's getting a little, it's going to get a little crowded. We've already got the furnace there. Yeah. We should, we should do that. Let's make like a little... No, I don't know. I was going to say like a, a little veranda here, but I don't know if we've maybe made it not so good because you can't access the veranda via your the door. Unless I can put a new door in, of course. I mean, there's always that. Okay. Uh, cut down this tree. Oh, and this bush apparently. <laughs> Cut down the tree. I've got to move out of the way because as we've learnt, uh, the tree can land on you and crush you. <laughs> I'm going to just quickly talk to these brothers. You look a bit... This one looks a bit green. He looks a bit sick. I hope he's okay. Hmm. Greg. Oh, that's right. I was supposed to find his mum. And I'm still supposed to find the creek. I don't know. Maybe Tara Brown. Imagine if Tara Brown comes up hmm. as something I have to, um, like a, like a contract with killing Tara Brown or something. That would be a little bit awkward, wouldn't it? <laughs> be a tad awkward. Just be like, oopsie. Yeah, 
Sorry, I've got to go and get your mum instead. Sorry. Alrighty. Cook some of this. That's always very handy having these. Um, let's make some more water as well. Uh, we'll make our steaks. There we go. Um, what if I put... Oh yeah, there we are. Let's make some of these. Alright, that'll do. Okay. Um, where's the entrance to our house? Let's, um, sleep for the night. Okay, I need some food and some water. Um, thirst, hunger, fatigue, health. It's not really what I'm after. That one, thirst and hunger, that'll do. The huckleberry bowl, they're quite good. Um, and we may as well drink a little bit of water as well. Okie dokie. The fish is quite good too. Let's go see if the tin has respawned and we'll go and mine the respawn tin. Great. Oh great, there's a lot of it. I wonder if we can get three. Wow, oh, we got three. Do we always get three? I thought maybe we didn't. I I was sort of sure that one of them was only um was one of them only like two once? I think it was. I mean I could be wrong. Oh yeah, look, that only gave us one. So the tin ore is not not always a good, you know, going to be three of them. Um, all right, let's get this furthest one first. All right, I feel like we're really getting somewhere now with all this tin. Dear. There we go. I'm just going to pop in and see the fisherman because I want to see if he's got um, any new updates quest-wise, etc. for us. You just never know. What's in his house? will probably get me in trouble for opening the box. Oh, feathers. You know what? I actually can use them. Oh, a book. Hello, Mr. Crude. Alright, do you have anything for me? Let's see his supplies. He's got leather boots. We've got those other shoes, don't we? A trout, a bass. Oh, what's this? A sturgeon. 120, get real. Oh, he's got rope. A common key. Um, I might take the common key because... Ah. So you gave me the common key, but... You've still got more in your inventory? Okay, I thought maybe it was a one-off, but clearly it's not. Um, scoop some water. We'll do a little bit of fishing while we're here. And we'll go see the lumberjack. Uh, what's it? Ah. Nice catfish. Oh, my backpack is full. No, my fish is going to go into the water. <laughs> Alright, that's fine. <laughs> um, okay. Where? Oh, there's a zombie over there. Let's go with. We'll go back home because we have to put some stuff into the. Um, 
our boxes at home because we clearly have inventory problems. <laughs> um, let's make a few pieces of flint. I don't know if that is st like our inventory problems mean that we can't pick up these things. Okay, we seem okay. Okay, let's smelt up the metal that we received. How many can we do? Eight, ten, uh, will we get four bars? Great. Um, okay. Maybe we should try some more. Have we made wooden planks and wooden beams? I think we did on the last one. Let's have a little look. Um, where's my inventory? Resources. Yeah, wooden beam and wooden planks. So they're for homes. Okay. So we probably should... Maybe put them back. Um, oh, I see. It's the consumables I've run out of. Remove my backpack. Is that how it goes? It looks like it. Alright. Um, okay, how, do I have room in this box? I do. Um, actually, let's see. Do I have to... Yes, I can eat some of those. So I need health and water and probably uh, fatigue I mean I'm gonna sleep anyway but these are taking up like one slot each at least these like grilled fish skewers for example at least they stack and so do the berries they stack too um, okay so we need clay to increase our workbench by another tier. I'm not exactly sure where to get clay. Um, so that's something we'll have to work out. Um, I wonder if we've got time to kill bandits. Let's try. They're only over here. Past these guys. No, are they? I thought they were just here. Where did I put them? Oh, I put them behind the <laughs> behind the trading post. That's right. Okay, so I kind of want to think about what we're doing because um, I don't really want to be going around and around in circles here. Um, so the tin. Is there something that we haven't yet made with the tin? We've made the nails. I've upgraded my tools. Um, the only thing is really, uh, I guess, upgrading the house. What about the tannery? Does that have anything? No. Oh, that's right, because I looked through already, didn't I? A trap. A trap to catch things both wild and lost. Hmm. How do you get scrap metal? I mean, the scrap parts, I wonder. It must be from just... Must be from just doing quests, I guess. Gosh, I really want an iron ingot and a birch bark. Iron ingot. Um, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna rest. I can't rest yet? Okay. Well, I may as well place down a world piece, but I would like to go and see the lumberjack. I'm going to place down another piece of map just over where the, the lake is, and we'll continue the lake. There's some more tin ore. That's great. Um, yeah, okay. Okay, this is going to sound weird. What if I put water near the prairie? Could there be some clay 
with a piece like that? I have no idea, but I kind of want to try it and see if that would work. Um, let's put it up here. That might be a silly piece to place. Mm, did that look like there was clay at all there? I'm not sure. That's really hard to tell. Oh my god, I totally forgot about the perks. Whetstone. Whetstone sharpens your weapons. Your melee damage is increased by 3. Level 2. Oh my gosh, I totally forgot about this. Improved fire making. Improves fire making equipment. Fires burn for 30% longer. Better cooking. Improves your cooking equipment. Cooked meals provide 20% more replenishment. And dry wood. Wood used for bonfires is more dry and flames burn hotter. Restored fatigue while near bonfires is increased by 50%. Let's go to better cooking. Level 3. Increase your workbench level and shelter to unlock more perks. Oh, I need to... Un okay. Alright, new mission. We're going to upgrade our shelter. I don't know exactly what that means. I'm guessing it's probably using the planks from the sawmill rather than just the crude like logs that we have so let me see where's our sawmill let's make a few more planks and what's this one again wooden beams let's make some of those as well okay so let's go to our workbench a log door now they're the ones we don't want because we've already got those um, an arch, a wooden arch. Hmm. Okay, tier three, tier four. Okay, let's go. Tier four. Oh, plank foundations require wood planks and tin nails. I wonder if I can just make a few of these to extend. Plank gabled roof. Mm -hmm. Plank cornered roof. Actually, I feel like we could have used our plank gabled roof in our current home. Okay, let's make... I want to make one of these foundations. Because I want to see if we get any extra um, blueprints if we make these things. I need some more tin nails. Let's make some of those. Oh, I need four more wooden planks. Okay, four more wooden planks. We can do that. Not the cartography table, sawmill. <laughs> oh, I need lumber. Okay, let's check our um, let's check these boxes of resources. There we go. Too easy. Is that what I needed? I can't remember. <laughs> okay, tier four. Yes. Alrighty. Okay, let's just put these plank foundations on the side here. Okay. One, two, and three. Um, where is my hammer? My building hammer? There we are. Um, hmm. I don't really want to take out these walls, do I? Because my bed and everything's there. Unless I can move it. Oh, change slash upgrade. Oh, I can upgrade the walls. Well, like, I would love to put a door somewhere here. Instead of that window. Can I do that? I think I've got, um, what happens if I tear it down? No, get out of the build mode. Can I put a can I put a door here? I'll have to maybe move the wooden box, but that's okay. Um, let's make some more bits and bobs. I might have to make some more. Oh, I didn't know I could go through there. Can I? No, <laughs> I was gonna say I didn't think I left a big enough gap. 
Um, let's make some more of these. Uh, and let's make, I want to make a door, but the fourth tier one, a plank door. Let's make one of those. Yeah, beautiful. Okay. So building and that one, let's place that here. There we go. And now we can go inside. We can just just scoot past the storage, that's fine. Um, I don't really know why I've done that, but that's fine. <laughs> you know, I could make this door here. I could change that to just be a wall. Um, and then we could just use the other door as the, the main entrance. We could do that, actually. Let's try that. Um, how do I make a... Actually, can I make a window? That would be quite nice. A plank window. Oh, that looks nice. Let's do that one. And instead of, uh, where's my hammer? Instead of just like tearing it down, I'm going to see if I can change it. There we go. Change. I want it to be a log door. Yes. No, I don't want it to be a log door. I want it to be. Oh, the window. It did it. Perfecto. <laughs> I feel very accomplished. All right. Get out of the build mode. So how will I know if I have a tier, was it a tier three house? Um, I don't even know. Um, what did, oh God, I can't remember what I needed to upgrade that for. Um, okay. Wooden planks. I wonder if I can upgrade the roof. That would be quite nice, wouldn't it? Well, let's get some wooden planks. Let's just go for it. It doesn't really matter. Oh my gosh, what do I have? I have 23 lumber on me. Okay, let's make a few more of these bad boys. <laughs> May as well. All right. Let's see if I can make this gabled roof. Ah, oh, actually, looking at it now. Yeah, no, I no, I think that's. I think I could use that. Do I? Hmm. I don't know. Let's make one and just see how it fits to the home. Because I'm thinking. At this bit here, where this is a flat roof, maybe I could make it so that this bit is the gabled bit there. So let's see. I'm not sure if, how this works, but we will find out. Um, so essentially it needs to go like this. Yeah. Okay. Can I change that with my building hammer? Let's see. Change. Okay. Will it... Be the correct e. Okay, that's not exactly. Can I rotate that? Oh, I can. Okay, that's kind of what I wanted. And I say kind of. <laughs> I say kind of. So I think I need two more of those. Let's see. Um, what's that? A corner roof, a plank roof. Um, you know what? I don't know if this is right. Let's just make two more of these and see what happens. Um, okay, let's zoom out a little. Um, so I need my hammer. All right, let's see. Oh my gosh. I think it's I think it's working. Not that one. <laughs> that one did not work. Um, okay. It looks pretty terrible. Let's have a view on this side. Yeah, look, it looks pretty terrible because it's such a mismatch of things. Um, but that's alright. That's alright. It's not it's not it's not the world's worst 
you know, <laughs> it's not the world's worst. I'm going to see if I can make a few more of these foundations out the front and maybe wrap it around the side. I think that would look really nice. Um, I'll take out this tree. Although, the tree's kind of nice there. Oops, not that button. Um, that tree's nice too. This one here. Maybe, we'll, maybe I'll just add a few more on the side just for now. So I need three. Let's just do that for now. Three foundations. Alright, what do I need? I need more wooden planks and I need nails. This game's a bit funny, it doesn't automatically register that you've opened the you've opened the menu from the crafting bench that you need it to. It's very strange. How did I say? Three. Wooden pl oh god, I need twelve wooden planks? Okay, my bad. That's a bit more than I need, but I know that I'll be probably using them. Alrighty. Alright. I've got five of them? How did I do that? Oh, look, it really doesn't matter, does it? Um, okay. And then the railings would be really nice. How do I make the railings? I think they were lower down on the tier list. Yeah. Oh, here come our branches. <laughs> We've had those branches. Oh my gosh. Whoop. Um, I'm not going to put a railing there because that might annoy me if I try to go from the workbenches. Let's put a railing here. That would be quite nice. Um, yeah, alright. We can just leave it there for now. Oh, my building has increased to 8. Okay. All right, she's exhausted. Let's let's sleep. Um, hmm. <sighs> okay. Look at that, lovely. Um, let's eat something. Alrighty. Gosh, look at our building. It looks super nice. Well, super nice. I don't know. I want to be generous to myself. <laughs> Let's go and kill all of the zombies. Where were they? I've forgotten. Behind the... <laughs> they were behind the um, makeshift post. Oh, sugar. Here they are. Look, they have like... Okay, why do they keep... I don't know. They're just like... Just like spawning in and out. Okay, come on. Where are you? They're like here, and then they're not here. Alright, can I get you from here? That's not the button I meant to press. What the hell? Need to aim for the legs. Oh, he only took two. Man, this guy's psycho with his bombs. Why is he blowing himself up? <laughs> He's just blowing himself up. Alright. Let's... Oh, that's right. I can't loot the guys with the bombs. That's weird. A deck of cards... 
What else can I get? Ooh, look at this guy. Oh my god, why are you missing? Jeez, it only takes a couple. I gotta like aim at their legs. Oh, she moved. That was not part of the plan. <laughs> I was gonna say, what now you aggro? Okay. Alright, bomb man, let's go. No? God, you gotta be fully precise, but on the legs. It's very strange. Oh, I was hoping maybe I'd get lucky and it would hit. Oh, hello. You've got a gun. Oopsie. Okay, that's kind of cool. Yep. Oh my god. Okay, oh, okay. Cool. Can I loot your gun? Hello, Mr. Gunman. Can I loot your gun? You look like a mafia boss. What? I can't loot you? Are you joking? Oh, gosh. Well, that was disappointing. I thought I could get his gun. Alright. Let's take out these dudes. Okay, cool. And then this lady, she looks like she's got a gun too. Oh my god. Why is it? <laughs> I need something that like has like a lock on aim. <laughs> Alright, let's collect some of this stuff. Can I collect something from this other gun lady? No, I can't. Okay. Fine, keep your guns to yourself. I don't mind. <laughs> let's go hand this in. Get a few bits and bobs on the way. Abigail Blackwood, Silas Reed. Retrieve the merchandise. We'll go Abigail. I mean Silas. We'll do the do the seven star one. Okay, mm. the clerk. Come on, mate. Have you got anything good for me? Let's ask about received mail. I can't believe I haven't done that yet. Have you ever received mail for me? Let me see. What's the name? My name is Ayana. One moment. Ah, oh, yes. Here it is. The letter in your name. Oh, gosh. It's on the table outside. Ah, great. Here we go. Dear Ayana, I hope you have been well. Times are troubled at our village and we could use your help. Can you please come and see us as soon as you can? Your friend... Shay Shayan Shayan Beautiful Find the village. Alright, find Kachita Village. Ooh, let's go to the cartography table. Oops, wrong wrong one. <laughs> let's go home. This is exciting now we've got a new piece. We've got lots of different things we can do now. So in the episode today, we have constructed the base a bit more. Um, we've got a new quest to find this new village. So let's research that. We'll pop that down. And then next episode, we will go and take a look for Ayana's friend. Uh, yeah, let's do this one. Research that. Kachita village. Oh, cold. What's this? <gasps> Pine for a snow covered forest. That is very cool. Oh, moderate climate. I get it. Alright, cool. Let's put down the village. Okay, that's a pine one. Okay, let's put that there. Beautiful. Alright, I say, guys, we leave it there for today. We'll. Next episode, go to the Kachita village. We'll see our friend and see what's going on. 
So thanks everyone for watching the episode today. Really appreciate it. Um, we're making some good progress here on Above Stakes, and I will see you in the next episode. Thanks so much. Bye-bye.